Hey, what's up everybody? Chris here with another Proto Tech Tip. And today I'm gonna go over why we don't recommend a secondary finish like anodizing on your no finish parts. So part of our robust custom manufacturing means that we offer several different types of finishes so that the parts that you design can have the specific functions and aesthetics that you require. These include a few different types of bare metal finishes, including a vibratory finish, grain finish, and media blasting. We've got links below to Prototech Tip videos specifically about those finishes. But for today's video, I wanted to focus specifically on one bare metal finish called No Finish. No Finish means that your part has, as you might guess based on the name, no finish applied to it. Your sheet metal part will go through a simple deburring process after it has been laser cut to remove any burrs or sharp edges, but otherwise, our team applies no other finish. This means that there will be swirl marks, scratches, or other blemishes that are produced during the manufacturing process. No finish is an option if you have functional parts that are not going to be on display. We definitely don't recommend it for any parts that are going to be displayed professionally. Some designers choose it because it's technically the most economical option, but compared to other bare metal finish options, the cost savings is pretty nominal. Still, we are here to make what you need so that you can keep your projects moving. And in some cases, no finish parts are the best fit for your needs. But if you're going to go with the route of no finish, we really don't recommend applying any other finishes such as anodizing or chemical conversion coating. These finishes are not opaque. All of those swirl marks, scratches, smudges, and other blemishes of your no finish part will still be very much visible once your part has been treated with anodizing or chem film coating. As you can see in these samples here beside me, the no finish parts still have the same look to them, even when it's been treated with chem film or anodizing. Unless your custom parts will not be on display or not visible at all, it's not a good idea to have anodizing or chem filled applied to a no finish part. By contrast, here's what a grain finish part with anodizing and a grain finish part with chem film actually look like. Much better. As always though, we are here to make your custom parts to the exact specs that you require. Your Protocase account manager is happy to quote you different options so that you can see the slight differences in prices for things like grain finish compared to no finish. If you have any questions or want to discuss your options, our team is here to help. So thanks for watching this week's Prototech Tip video, and we'll see you back here again next week.